I'm Stephanie Shaw um, and I'm on the Fine Art Foundation here at Central St Martins. I think being an art student and starting in art so young, drawing was one of the first things that I know I certainly learned to do and I think it's such an expressive way, especially when you're young, of you know creating something that you're proud of and something that really expresses your personality and you as a person. I think drawing is important as well because it lends itself to so many different areas, you know, not just art, you know, science, anything else. You can pick up a pencil and draw and I think it's very universal in that way. We are doing a human drawing, so the idea was of getting people in to draw with us and we've got a camera up there so that's why we've got these square hats. So it looks like pixels and we're drawing with human beings and how they interact with us. The children love it. Hi, my name is Ignacia. We're doing the uh, Lost Letters printmaking <laughs> workshop. So what you do is you pick a letter, you draw on it, and then we cut a stencil and we screen print it. So you get a, an object and a lovely print. So I think it's important to do things you don't usually do on a daily basis, so to just expand and yeah. Drawing is like, it should be more a part of, of life, like reading, writing, drawing, why not? Uh, it's been crazy and really interesting and I think people are really enjoying it, so yeah, it's been great. I'm Richard, I'm an architecture student at the Central St. Martins. And today we are doing a, uh, like a drawing in space, like a, creating a three-dimensional object from bamboo sticks. The main key is not to think too much about what you're creating, you just create something by connecting like the ends of the bamboos. It's not the same as drawing on a paper, but it's drawing like in three-dimensionally. So that's what we call drawing in space, so it's a kind of imaginary thing. When you also say drawing in space, it kind of leads people and the kids to imagine something else, not like just making something. It, it makes them flow their imagination. From my perspective as an architecture student, drawing is extremely <laughs> important because it's, it's it's the best way how to communicate and, and express your ideas really quickly. So my name is Kate and I'm second year BA Fashion Design and Knitwear student um, at St. Joseph Martins. And I'm Alex and I'm also a second year knitwear student at St. Martins. So we're dressed in our finest <laughs> model for the left drawing class. So everyone is coming and drawing us basically and we are just changing our outfits and serving looks. <laughs> My name is Kate May. Um, I'm just doing a little workshop about performance and drawing. So it's like performative drawing, and it's just about allowing the charcoal to take a, take you for a walk across a piece of page, and just drawing each other in motion. Drawing is a way of writing, isn't it? It's a way of describing something. We can all sort of. It's important to have that sort of tactile feeling. There's nothing quite like putting a piece of paper and a pencil to a piece of paper and trying to work out an idea. I think it's, it's that slow, slowness of drawing and it gives you time to think about what you are actually doing. It's been good. It's been good. We've had loads of, like, lots of interests and lots of people taking part. I use drawing a lot in my own practice. I'm a performance artist and a costume designer and I use it continuously as I think it's the best way to try to express not only like a concept but also an emotive feeling and that's what I do when I make live performance. I want to sort of transform somebody from their everyday moments and the way to describe that is to try and, I try and work it out through drawing what I'm doing. I think today's been like a really excellent day. It's very important to get kind of the whole community and everybody involved in something like this. And even if you don't particularly like art and you're not good at drawing and you're not good at painting, I think today has just showed that there are so many more ways to make art than just picking up a pencil. You know, we've had fashion, we've had graphics, illustration, and I think really getting involved in something physical as well is good for getting children involved. And you know, they love running around, especially with like silly paper hats on. So I think today's been a really good day.